Now we had two terms in the energy balance, summation of the incoming streams and outgoing streams. Now what I will do, I will convert them to their corresponding mole basis equivalents. And in order to convert them to their mole basis equivalents, I have to do a little trick. Instead of mass flow rate, I will divide it by its molecular weight, and it will immediately become Fi, molar flux of the incoming stream. And of course, in order to have dimensional consistency, my enthalpy should have an underscore. This one is enthalpy per unit mass. This is enthalpy per unit mole, molar enthalpy. Similar here, all right, outgoing stream, Fi, Hi, with an underscore. So I'm going to substitute Fa terms here for the incoming stream, Fa terms, Fi terms here for the outgoing streams. Okay? So my flow reactor is a black box. It is operating at steady state. As a result, my time-dependent term in the energy balance doesn't have to enter into consideration. Zero is equal to, let us see what we can write for the incoming stream. F A in, H A in, plus F B in, H B in, plus F R in or F P in, H P in, plus F R in, H R in. So this is the incoming stream. For the outgoing stream, F A out, F A out is this. F A in times 1 minus X. F A in times 1 minus X times H A out. F B out. Yes, it is F A in times theta B minus B over X. F A in times theta b minus b over a times x. I have to put a minus sign, put a square bracket here. Plus fp out, it is fa in times theta p plus p over a times x plus fr, fa in times theta r plus r over a times x. What other terms do we have? We have Q, we have shaft work. All right, so this is our energy balance. Now I'm going to group similar terms together. Everything has F A in, 
F A in, H A in, F A in, H A out. Zero is equal to F A in. Let me get a square bracket. H A in minus H A out. Then I have FB in or in this global FA in parentheses, I can write plus theta B times. So FA in, HA in minus HA out plus. Now, instead of FB in, since I have FA in in the parentheses, I write theta B, HB in minus HB out. It has taken care of uh, I have to have H B out here. I miss those terms. H P out. And of course, H R out. Okay. Plus theta p h p in minus h p out plus theta r h r in minus h r out. So this has taken care of the first terms, F A in, and these first terms, one, the term with theta, the term with theta, the term with theta. Now I have to take care of the second terms, the terms that have x, all right? So I'm going to have, I have a minus, minus, plus, hmm? plus. F A in times X. I have H A out. Plus B over A times H B out. Minus it is plus, it's going to make it minus. P over A times HP out. Minus R over A times H R out. Now this term, this term is minus delta H reaction. So when I sum this up in Concise form, I obtain zero equals to F A in 
summation. of all the terms of theta i summation over all the species theta i of h in minus h out plus f a in times x times minus delta H reaction plus heat plus shaft work. All right, this is the steady state energy balance for a reactor. This is the reaction heat. This is the heat transfer. This is the reaction heat. This is the heat transfer. Do not confuse those two terms. 